Hey you guys, hey you guys. It's your girl, the real true divine feminine here, and I come to have a real talk with Brie moment right quick. You guys, so somebody is literally mad because you are not struggling. Somebody has been trying to do things behind the scenes to make you struggle, to make you be codependent, to make you lose everything, and they are mad. I'm not understanding why people are so pressed and bothered by what you have going on. For the simple fact, everybody does not spend money the same. Everybody is not all into this material wealth stuff. See, some people may have come from poverty, so they learn how to balance their stuff. A lot of people not understanding money is not goddamn everything. Because let me tell you, a lot of people who have money, they buy friends, they buy coochie, they buy D, they they buy they they buy all kind of drugs, they do all the rest of this stuff to make their self happy and they still don't be happy at the end of the day. They have to stay on some type of drug, they have to stay on some type of something because they have all that money and they're miserable. I don't know why people think that having worldly possessing stuff is all that because it's not you cannot take none of that shit with you that's not gonna be behind no hearse that's not gonna be none of that and people fail to realize that people want to make you oppress make you broke make you be in lack of nothing listen you have, you might not be the riches of the riches, but you're comfortable with what you have. You're not into competition to try to compete with nobody. You're not doing any of that. And these people want you to be that type of way. These people want you to be robbing Peter to pay Paul. They want you to be borrowing. They want you to be living paycheck to paycheck. You might be doing all that. I don't know. It, it And it's not nobody else's business if you are. These folks need to learn how to mind their own business. They need to learn how to worry about their own household because the grave that they're trying to dig for you is going to be for them. Somebody is going to get themselves hurt in this situation. Somebody is going to get hurt very bad by trying to apply, uh, plan to rob you, doing all kind of stuff to stop your money, put you in financial crisis, financial debt. They're going to try to, they, they've been trying to do all kinds of stuff and it's not working. It is not working because it's not meant for you to be going through some of that. This is what people fail to realize. Y'all, if you dislike somebody and you're doing all kind of stuff to this person, but still they rise because nothing that you're doing is meant to impact their life. Everybody is not meant to struggle. Everybody is not meant to go through heartache, torment, and pain. Y'all have to respect that. Everybody is meant to go through different things on their journey in life, and you have to allow somebody to go up on their journey. Stop trying to play God in somebody's life and get your own life together. You cannot be consumed, worried about somebody else's life so much. Because when you're worried about somebody else's life and what they got going on, your shit goes undone. You too busy trying to stop somebody else from achieving, living, fulfilling their destiny and their purpose. And the whole while you're losing your house, you're losing your car, your body foul and sick and doing all the rest of that. If y'all learn how to take the time and go see a psychiatrist, a, 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 a physician, a dermatologist, a dentist, if y'all take the time to go see these people, the way y'all focus on other people's life, your body wouldn't be aching. You wouldn't be sick. You wouldn't be doing this and doing that. You wouldn't be, if you learn how to put your focus on your business, you wouldn't be behind on your bills. You wouldn't be sleeping on somebody else's couch. You wouldn't, your cars wouldn't get repossessed. You wouldn't be going through all this stuff if you learn how to stop focusing on somebody else's business and focus on your shit. Get your shit done. You heard me? Get your shit done. Make sure you and yours is straight, taken care of, and good. Instead of trying to hurt somebody else. Stop somebody else's money. Stop somebody else's shine. Stop somebody else. That shit don't go like that. You cannot do that. Learn to take care of you and yours. For the like of me, I don't understand why is it so hard for people to worry about their own household, to worry about their own bank account, to worry about their own children, to worry about what they have going on in their life. 
for some reason. It, it, it just, they just can't do it. Whoever these people are, this person, whoever these people are, they want to destroy you. They fail to realize. My favorite saying to everybody is you cannot break what you did not build. I don't give a damn how close you try to get somebody. What you try to, what you think you may know about somebody. Nothing you could say or do will break them because you did not build them. That's what y'all fail to realize. Whoever these people is, they want you to, they really want to borrow some money from you. That's what they really want to do. They really want, they really mad because they ain't got no money and they know you got some. But then instead, they trying to stop your money. They're trying to, you cannot stop. Listen, you could call somebody a job 150 times. If they lose their job, they'll get a better one. God always have stuff in store for his people. And if you ain't winning right now, because it's just not your goddamn season, except that it's not your season and go on and work and prepare for when it is your season. Prepare for what you're going to do when it is your winning season. Stop trying to hurt, harm, discredit somebody else because they on their shit, because they doing what they supposed to do, because they standing strong. Some of you guys, it be people that's in marriages, couples, mad because you single and you doing it by yourself. I don't understand that. It Listen, everybody hustle different. Everybody got, some people got a dog in them. Some people got a beast in them. Some people got a hog in them. Some people just, that's what it is. And some people ain't just got nothing in them. They ain't got no ambition, no nothing. They ain't no go-getters. They just some perfect pretenders. That's what it is. But whoever they are, they need to be them and allow you to do you and stop trying to hurt you. Stop trying to stop your money. Stop trying to do all the rest of this because the minute something go wrong in their life, guess what they want to blame? They want to blame you and you ain't even know that their asses was doing something to you. But they click to put the blame on you. They have no self-accountability for shit that they do and they don't go like that. It's self-accountability for what you do, how you do it, why you doing it. Don't be jealous of nobody. You don't know nobody's struggle. You don't know what nobody has to get to to where they at right now. So stop being jealous and stop trying to hurt and harm somebody. Just stop. That shit is stupid. Go pray somewhere. Go get your mind right somewhere. Go get some help that you need. Go sit on somebody's couch and tell them why you feel like you're not worthy enough. Why you feel like you got to stop somebody else's money. Why you feel like you got to stop somebody else's shine. That shit don't go like that. Go, go sit and tell somebody what you have going on so they can help you through your issues that you are facing because you are facing hell of a issues to try to do something to harm somebody else because you broke, busted, and disgusted. Man, get your life together and get it quick. Like, real talk. Because that don't make no sense for you to be that type of way. For real. Whoever these people are, they're just ignorant. They just, they're just ignorant. Like, real talk. They ignorant and... They just want you to, I don't know why. They really want you to be out here bumming. They don't want you to have nothing. I'm talking about they want you to be, they want you, if you have kids, they want you and your kids to be on the streets. They want you to lose your car. They just want you to be, just have nothing because they're jealous of your strength. They're jealous of the power that you possess within you. And whoever you are, I want to tell you, man, keep going. Keep your foot on your, on their necks, man. Don't stop. The sky has no limit. Baby, you can be whatever you want to do. You can reach whatever you want to reach. Ain't nobody. There's no competition. Ain't nobody stopping you but you. Do you. Don't let nobody tell you what you can't do. Continue to do you by all means necessary. Continue to press your way forward. Continue to, to whatever you do, it, do it gracefully and do it in love. No, God got your front back, your side. You got to continue to trust him. And when these people are going to learn how to trust them, God going to open doors for them. And tell them they're going to they gonna keep falling. They're not going to get ahead because they keep trying to tear down somebody who's not meant to be broken. Who's not meant to be broke. They keep trying to do it because of jealousy, envious, and they don't have the strength within them. They, they see you. They see you strong. They see you a go-getter. They see that you're making it happen by yourself. And they don't like it because they can't do it. So, you know, you know, if you know, you know. Now, let me go make my money tea. So, it should get a retro device in a minute. Y'all have a blessed and prosperous day. Peace.